Hey, today we're taking a look at what's new and QB. So here we start off in the garden and these garden ornaments are really cool. There's a squirrel, there's a train, there's an aeroplane. These are really cool. They're made of metal. I think they were all $22.99. There was also a peacock one. There was a chicken one. So if you're looking for a really fancy garden ornament, these are hand painted as well. Next I found this. This was a pelican. I don't exactly know what you do with it. It goes in your garden. It was quite expensive, but each to their own. Next we were looking at these beautiful bed linen. Um, these are double bed spreads with little cute birds on in a teal or a yellow. I thought these were so cute. Next I was looking at cushion covers and this one says hugs and kisses. It came in a black and it also came in a brown colour. These were a really nice size. They kind of had that hessian feel. So if you're looking for something for like a country or a kind of rustic look to your living room, these would fit in quite nicely. Next we went to the pet section and they had these really cool bowls, obviously remembering to keep your pets hydrated as well as yourself during the heat wave. And these were $1.29 and they came in a variety of colours. These were also kind of cool, these were little Russell toys and they were basically just a pocket full of um, catnip. My cat doesn't like catnip so it's not really for him. Next I found these really cute mugs with birds on, my favourite obviously being the magpie on there. They didn't have a raven on there so I was quite disappointed and didn't buy one. <laughs> Next I found these, this says always on the run and this was a rabbit collection they have. They have tea towels, oven gloves, mugs, it was a cute little collection for the summer. These were also kind of cool if you want to have these outside. These were just little trinket tray mats, but you could use these outside on your tables during the summer. They were just 99p, but there was only one black one, so I didn't buy one. These are Emma Bridgewater um, breakfast, lunch and dinner collections, if you want to call it that. Um, they came in this mouse print for the girls, and then for the boys, they had this tractor print. You get a cup a plate, a spoon, knife and fork I believe. Cute little set for £18. These were kind of cool, again as I said keep hydrated during this hot weather. These water bottles came in a range of colours at £2.99. Um, good for men or for women or kids. Next I thought these were kind of cool with us being in the six weeks holiday as of today. These little Mentos puzzles were £1.99. They have around 50 pieces, so quite fun. These are also kind of cool. These are Willy Wonka kind of golden ticket storage boxes. I think they were $2.49 or $3.49. Cute little thing to keep odds and ends in. These were kind of cool. These were the little candles that I found. The EW range. They're kind of fancy candles. They have quite a lot of burn time and they're $5.99 though. These were kind of cute, these were obviously kind of simplistic, they were $4.99 but they came in lavender, linen, um, lavender was probably my favourite. Then we went on to these really cute little soap slices, honeybee and lime and black pepper. The black pepper one actually smelled really nice. These were kind of cool as well. These were obviously from Bomb Cosmetics. This one says your one fine apple. And obviously it's a pineapple flavoured bath bomb. These are currently um, in QD. They've been there for a while. This one was called Toucan Tango. I believe they are... I can't remember. I think they're 2 99 each. This, again lime and pepper i thought they were kind of cool um obviously i've accidentally put a second picture in uh these are kind of cool this was my favorite one that i found this was stick to the man manadarian this was absolutely gorgeous this smell was so good i didn't buy it though because there were so many to choose from 
Um, here we go. Here's some more really cool designs. I think they were about three pounds each. Is that too much for soap? Maybe. The mango one was quite nice. The peppermint one actually smelled like toothpaste. And the dark pleasures had that kind of dark undertone smell. These were also kind of cool if you want to look for Christmas presents. These were little cake slices that were soap. You had berry licious and raspberry. I think these would go quite well in the stocking. Then you got this one that said Superstar Surprise. This one had a kind of sweet cakey smell. Obviously they're going for that with the hence the slices. And then my personal flavour in the cake slices was Chocolate Heaven. It had such a sweet chocolatey smell. I think these were £3 a slice. Um, I thought they were kind of cool. Next, there was this box that you could get where you got a selection of a bath bomb, a bath soap. You got some of the soaps in there. And this was a little collection. These were a box that you could get for £10. Again, could be good for Christmas. This was everything I found today at QD. So if you want to like and subscribe and give me a big thumbs up and join me on my journey around QD. Or check out all my other videos that I do. I do load videos every day. And I will see you all tomorrow for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye guys.